What's going on everybody? Z here. Welcome back to another episode of Slime Rancher. So we're back. We're playing Slime Rancher. We're playing the update. And in this episode, we're going to unlock this wonderful looking place here. It's going to be so exciting. Oh my gosh, I can't wait. So if you like the video, don't forget to leave a like. If you are already, don't forget to subscribe as well. So uh, yeah, we're going to unlock it. Now to unlock this, to get to the point where I'm at now, if you haven't caught my other videos, you have to do this. Um, I think this is, this is going to be the third time that we've done this. The first time was 75 and then 120 then 150 and it says we're gonna unlock this place as our very own so you can see i already have 74 in there i only need 76 i've got 78 so let's go ahead and let's do this oh let's first seg oh it's gonna be so exciting we're gonna get a whole bunch of spicy tofu on the way there kind of wish this would shoot a little bit faster but that's okay builds to the excitement oh my gosh come on it's taking a while come on come on Come on. Should we do it? Or should we wait? No, let's wait. No, just kidding. <gasps> we did it. We did it. Okay. Now. Does it not do anything? Or does it just. Oh, it just it unlocked it. That's it. You know, I'm actually a little disappointed. I thought there would be like a little message dealio. Um, what? What do I do with this? Press E to activate. <gasps> the retreat is yours, but I'll be happy to give you a block of my. I said tofu for every three kookadubas you harvest from the wasp. Be careful. That's it. That's all I got. Can I go in here? No? What? Why? Oh. Wait. Can I go in here? No. Anywhere? Can I go in any of these? Or just like, this is his house. This is his house, huh? Mm-hmm. That's his house. That's what I thought. Okay, what about this little place over here? What is this? Okay, so there's a little toy deal. There's, there's, I can't do anything with these houses though. Huh. Okay, so we got this little house, house here. We got some wild carrots, and we got, um, you know, these whole like bubble tree things are kind of interesting. I don't know what those are. I don't know exactly what those are. Is this okay? Hold on, let's look over here first. All right, so these are all the same. Okay, let me put those there. So we got what four plots here. Got a plot there. We got uh, one here. Hmm. Okay. Now let's keep going this way. See what was down here. There's a treasure pod. Whole lot of nothing. Like there really isn't that much stuff down here. Open that guy up. What do we get? Oh. Oh. Like what am I gonna do with all that? Ooh, royal jelly. Ooh. Uh, let's just yeah. Royal jelly. And the strange diamond. Yeah, those are good things. Okay. So, okay, curious. Can I put stuff here? Okay, I can put one there, one there, there, and there. So, I mean, I guess you could decorate this place pretty neat. Um, I'm trying to think. Why? I was really hoping this would be a thing. I was hoping this would be a thing. Well, I mean, slime toys, I guess because you probably couldn't bring those through the teleporter. That would make sense. That would make complete sense. Um, but other than that, like, what do we... Is that it? That was like, I thought I was going to be able to go in here and do stuff. Okay, let's change the color. What do, what do you say? Uh, well, this is already the color though. Okay, Royalton. And the vac is going to be Royalton. Okay. All right. Is it Royalton? Oh, it is. Oh, it's so pretty. Okay. Uh, well, we did it. Um, what should we do with this stuff? We could do corrals. We could do saber corrals. But saber stuff isn't worth that much. I gotta say, it's not. It's not. It's not super valuable. Oh, hold on. You know what? They added. They added new toys. They added new toys. Um. Oh, a stego buddy reduces agitation of nearby slimes, especially saber slimes, who are the only slimes to have known the stegos in person. That's a okay. Let's get it. Oh, it's the cutest little thing. Look at it. It's the cutest little thing. It's a little stegosaurus. That's so funny. Okay. Uh, you know what? Let's go ahead and set up some. Let's set up some things here. Why not? Uh, let's do... Actually, let's do the corrals back here. We'll do a corral here. Purchase. Um, we'll do one here. And this is gonna be, these are going to be for the... Okay. Purchase. 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 We don't need the solar shield. Get that. And that. Okay. Good lord, that takes a lot of money. Okay, let's get this one and this one and that one. I wish you could just double click. 
Purchase that. And floor collector. Okay. We got two pins fully ready to rock and roll. Uh, which, we're gonna put saber stuff in there, obviously. Like, that, that's gonna happen. Um, you know what? Else. <gasps> oh, you know what we need to do? We need to build a, um, oh, we need to build the, the selling place here. The remote selling depot and the remote uh, storage depot. We need to put those here for sure. That's definitely a thing that's got to happen. You know, it's a really cool area. What the heck? That was weird. Um, this is a cool little area, but I'm I I feel like they should expand onto it maybe a little bit, maybe just just a hair. That'd be kind of cool. I think I think it'd be cool if they expand onto it a little bit more. Get some get some more stuff on here. Even like even if you had to buy areas, <gasps> it's a little slime stone. He's so happy. Okay. Um, we can throw that in there. Actually, you know what? Let's just grab another one, too. I'll throw it in both of them. Why not? Why and not? Uh, little Stego buddy. That's so cool. Okay. Uh, this guy. Nope, give me. Okay, come on. Alright, you're gonna go, uh, in... Yeah. There you go. Okay. So, let's go ahead. Let's go deposit this stuff back off in my science -y place. Now, we need to build a remote science depot and a remote... Uh, market depot. Oh, we had tars in here that killed the boss. Or something. I don't know how it happened. I don't know. I don't know how they got um, a hold of a a port from the third guy, but I have I really have no idea. I don't know. I just came out. There's tar music playing. I was like, what's going on? And they actually stayed in there for a minute. But can I put these in there? No. Will anybody eat these? Veggie, will you eat that? Did you eat that? No. Uh, veggie and meat. Any of these eat fruit? Fruit? Do you eat fruit? Okay. Will you eat this? Oh, he ate it! No, he didn't. Oh! There! Okay, that's interesting. Alright, so they eat it. That's cool. Um, okay, we got that. Now, what do we need? In order to get this place set up, we got to get this place for like fully set up. Warp tech, uh, refinery link, fabricate that guy, market link, fabricate that guy. That's it. That's all. I, I already got, I, I didn't have to go get anything for that at all. That was it. Nothing. That's funny. That is funny. Okay. So let's go and, hmm. Yeah, let's go get, let's go get some saber slimes. I'm trying to think what slimes we should put over there. Like, what should be the basic slime? Should we do mosaic slimes? Like, should we do like more mosaic slimes? Because we have a lot of mosaic slimes. Like, everything is a mosaic slime base. Um, Saber's worth quite a bit right now, and so is Dervish. Dervish is worth a lot, and so is Hunter. Um, Crystal. You know, everything's up right now. This is a good time to sell. Mosaic is down. Mosaic is down. Do not do mos. Uh, we could do dervish. I really don't have a lot of dervish slimes. Hmm. We could get some dervish. Um, should we do that? Should we do that now? Yeah, let's just go get some dervishes now. We'll go get some dervish slimes right now. Um, let's go ahead and do this. We'll sleep till morning and go to the desert and we'll get some of those guys. Hello, little dervish. Come with me. You'll be my friends. You're going to be so happy where I'm going to take you. I'm going to take you and I'm going to turn you into something that you're not. And then I'm gonna lock you in a pen and I'm gonna feed you only when it's convenient for me because I wanna harvest your poop and make money off it. Sound good? Oh, great. I'm so glad you're on board with this. Um, let's get one more. Let's do five and five. Okay, perfect. Perfect. Oh, it's perfect. Okay. So let's go back here. Um, you know, uh, we were talking about making like a warp depot and having one warp to take me to all the other warps. So that might be a thing too at some point. But for now, it's not. What are Dervish Slimes like? Hold on. Hold everything. What do you guys eat? What is your uh, prickly pear? That's okay. We can do that. That's fine. And then, yeah, that'll work because we can do the upgraded gardens. Prickly pear, that'll be fantastic. Easy enough. Okay, so one, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, you guys are going to enjoy it in there. <gasps> Look it. They're playing with the toy. Even though it's not their toy, they're all playing with it. Oh, they're so happy. Okay, a little stegosaurus toy. That's the the best toy by far. That thing is amazing. Just absolutely amazing. It's fantastic. Okay. Uh, so we need some plorts. Uh, you know, I'm actually kind of disappointed because there's really... What is the purpose of the tofu? That's what I want to know. What is the purpose in that stuff? Um, 
you guys need to like eat so that way I can have your uh your droppings, you know? Um I need those. I need those. Those ones. No, this that one. And that one and that one. Hey look at I don't need that though. And that one. Um yeah, well I don't really know what to do with the what do I do with that fruit? Like, is it even worth collecting anymore? Hmm. I don't know. You guys know? Let me know in the comments if you if you have an idea for it. We can't grow it, so I mean that's a thing. If we could grow it, I definitely would because it's a cool looking fruit. Looks like a dragon fruit kinda. Um How come you're not eating these chickens? Like I don't understand. These guys are so mad and mean. It was at six. Oh, I need like I need like four more. <laughs> four more! Okay, so I just thought of a use for the spicy tofu. If if it if the slime is hungry, they'll eat it. That means these guys will eat it. It doesn't have to be meat. They'll eat it. It's like easy peasy. And then like even I didn't even oh my gosh, I didn't even think about that. If they only like meat or if they only like veggies or whatever, they'll still eat the tofu. Like you could just mass farm tofu. <gasps> You could just farm tofu and you wouldn't have to do any. What is our pink slime doing here? I don't want you. Uh, yeah, so you could, um, hmm. Ha <laughs> ha! I figured it out. Okay, so, spicy tofu. Sorry, interjecting. Not in the timeline at all. This is actually after recording this episode, so I apologize. Spicy tofu. What is its benefit? I'm gonna tell you right now what its benefit is. They can, you can stuff the same slime with it over and over and over. Boom. Plorts, good to go. Okay, well, this is a different guy, but you, you'll see what I mean. You can just keep feeding them. They'll keep eating it and just over and over and over. There's no like full. They just keep going. It never fills them up. They can eat and eat and eat. So if you're like wanting a certain type of plort, you just throw your spicy tofu and you're good to go. Like say, hey, oh, maybe this one is worth a lot right now. Guess what? You get your spicy tofu going and you can uh, you can go ahead. Like, look, at they're just eating. Oh, my gosh. It's going so much faster. Oh, it's, it's crazy. Okay. So, uh, yeah, at this point in the video, these aren't even here yet. Uh, but yes, we're going to resume to our previously recorded episode. Enjoy. Okay. So we got the, well, we have 11 now, actually. So we got, we got even more than what we need. But we're going to go back. We're going to turn our, oh gosh, I can't remember. I just, I just, I'm pulling a blank. I wish that would take us back to, uh, to the wild, but it doesn't. I don't know why. Okay. Uh, our dervishes. That's right. We got dervishes. Okay. Uh, let's do one, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. Okay. This one missed. Fantastic. Now, where can I put? I need to put these somewhere that are easily accessible. While oh, this is absolutely perfect. Okay. E to access. Uh, utilities. Warp tech. Refinery link. Install. Then we'll do one here. Warp tech market link install. Okay. And then T to get out of that. Oh, fantastic. So these will go to the sciencey place and these will go to the market. Oh, I like it. Oh, look at Oh, they're so hungry. They look so funny. They look like walruses. I love it. They look like little walruses. That's so cool. Okay, so let's go ahead and feed these guys. Let's go ahead and feed them now. Actually, you know what? We'll just throw some spicy tofu in the, the deal as well, because I really don't know what else I'm going to use it for, to be completely honest. Um, let's turn this down. You know, I really kind of wish they would change this a little bit, because, like, even the slow setting isn't slow. We'll throw those in there, and we'll throw these in here as well, and then we'll go find us some prickly pears, and then we'll start some gardens as well. Let's go ahead and go slow. Okay, fantastic. All right, you guys stay here, hang out, have a good time, uh, play with your little toy. Should I get, like, more toys? Because they're like all fighting over the same one. They're all fighting over the same one. Or are they just doing that because that's just what they do? Like, even if they have more in there, they're each going to fight over the same one. You know, like dogs and every other animal. They always fight over the exact same one. Okay, there's that one. And then we'll throw this one over here. Okay, so there's two in there. And we'll throw a second one in here. Look at it! There you go! There's two. Okay, fantastic. So, we're going to go find some prickly pears. Which should be pretty easy. I wonder if I can put any teleports in here. Eh, no. Darn it. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. You know, actually, if we really, really, really wanted to, we could move the teleport. We could build our own teleport, like our own colored one. And then we could always put it over there, but we're not going to do that. We're not going to do that. Okay, prickly pear time. Let's go. Okay, we got ourselves some prickly pears. Now, 
We're going to build the uh, gardens right up here, I think. I think it's a good spot for garden. Okay, purchase that. And purchase everything. Oh my gosh! It's such a pretty garden. I love it. Okay, that'll go in there. <gasps> Look at the three prickly pear trees. Oh, they're so cool. I love this garden upgrade. This thing's amazing. It's amazing, I tell you. Amazing. Okay, so... I was thinking, this is what I was thinking. I always, I come up with ideas a lot. I come up with a lot of ideas. So uh, bear with me here. I really think it'd be cool is if they came up with some some type of like automation system. Maybe like a helper or something like a, a robo slime. Robo slime assistant. Oh, I like it. I like it. Okay. Uh, if they use that, it was my idea. And basically what that would do would be like you could assign it a job so like say oh collect this stuff and feed it to these or collect these and feed it to those and those you know i think that'd be kind of cool because it would get like in super end game like end game you've already gotten everything and you're just in it for the money now like uh i don't know if you guys have played the game like on your phone called like adventure capitalism or like egg ink or whatever where you just start making a lot of money well basically kind of like that where you can just automate it let it do its thing and these will automatically feed, it'll collect those, sell them for whatever it's worth, and your money will just like continue trickling up. And then you can have like super, super expensive upgrades. Um, I think that'd be kind of cool. So uh, that's just my idea anyways, but okay, we got those going. Should I build like, hmm, whoa, you guys sound vicious. Are you hungry already? Oh my gosh. These guys look like they're hungry already. Uh, let's go ahead, wow. I mean, you can like see these things growing. Oh my gosh. Okay, uh, let's go ahead and give one, two, and one, two. Perfect, and you should give me double the plorts, right? Fantastic, absolutely fantastic. Okay, so these guys are all, yeah, they're they're doing their thing, doing the thing, okay. I don't know that these are gonna be enough. Is this one gonna be enough to sustain these? Or should I build two more? I mean, we could always build two more. We could always demolish them if we need to. Hmm. Man, I don't know what to do. I'm really disappointed that you can't go in those houses. Honestly, like that's that's super upsetting. I wish you could go in this house. It doesn't make any sense. It doesn't make any sense. I tell you. Okay. You know what? Let's go ahead. Let's let's throw let's throw more gardens here. Why not? Uh, we'll just upgrade all of it, and then we'll. I know we're gonna get way too like <laughs> we're gonna we're gonna have so much food. It's gonna be ridiculous. But that's okay. Um. Should we grow particularly pears in there as well? Can I take any of these yet? I can't take any of these yet, okay. Uh, so we're gonna have to wait. We're gonna have to wait for these guys to go, and then we'll be able to plant them in there. And we'll be able to do that. Okay, what else? Is there anything else I'm missing about this place? Like, I feel like I'm missing something. I feel like there's more. There's always more, and I feel like I'm missing it. Um, I don't see anything, okay. You know, this almost looks like you're in the moss blanket. Wait, why do you have to have the moss blanket unlocked? Huh, I wonder. I really wonder. You know what, let's explore a little bit, shall we? Oh, I can't, oh. Let's do a little exploration. Let's see if we can see where we're at. Uh, there's no map as well. Yeah, see, this is this is the, the current map, and it's like, question mark, a, uh, wait, what is? Is that just saying it doesn't know where I am? Oh, location unknown. Okay. Uh, why do you have to have the moss blanket unlocked, though? I'm really kind of curious about that. Uh, okay, let's get on top of this tree. Oh. Oh, it's not going to last. What if we What if we go around it? Let's go around it. Oh, we should wait. Okay, let's go. We're going to wait. Okay, I don't think you can go anywhere. I think this is pretty much it, because this, this is like the end of the ledges. So, that's there's nothing there. Okay, what is this? Why is there a tree in a glass bubble? Like... Am I supposed to be able, like, not to breathe? Where, where are we? I want to know where we are, and I want to know why you have to have the moss blanket unlocked. That is, that's really weird. That you specifically have to have the moss blanket unlocked. I mean, I understand, I understand the, uh, the overgrowth area, because, like, that's how you get here. But why the moss blanket? That doesn't make any sense to me. Do you guys know? Let me know what you think. I mean, if you have a theory, or if maybe you actually know, and there's, like, I'm just dumb and I'm missing something. <laughs> that, I mean, that, that can very well happen. Uh, okay, plant that there, plant that there, fantastic, we're gonna harvest all these guys, all these bad boys, and we're gonna feed our happy guys, make them happy again, make them start producing for us, oh, it's gonna be so exciting, I think we're gonna have to kick this up a little bit, I, these guys are really hungry, 
And you know, this side had a lot more in it. Oh, you know what? I just had a lot more. Ah, okay. I grabbed some. I was like, I was like, why did this side have so much more? Just because I grabbed from the other side. Mm hmm. Okay. So we kicked it up a notch because these guys are all hungry, and I've had food in here for a little bit already, so it should have fed them enough, I think, to like make them not hungry. Yeah, it's obviously feeding them pretty quickly because they're already at both at 18. Fantastic cookies. So once these are grown, we'll have a we'll have a food source for them. Once those are good, we'll have a food source as well. And you know what? That's going to be the end of this episode, guys. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, don't forget to smash that thumbs up button if you haven't already. Don't forget to subscribe as well. Let me know what you guys want to see. Let me know if uh, if you have any input on any of those things I asked throughout the entire episode. You can just comment down below. And I'll see you next time.